Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to our channel. It's Taylor. And yes, today I'm doing another Ulta haul. Why? Because I have a shopping problem. If you guys liked the video, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and follow us on Instagram. That's all for the intro. Let's get started because my battery is flashing. The first thing I picked up is the Max Fix Plus. This is one of my favorite setting sprays besides Urban Decay All Nighter. I haven't used it in a few years, so I picked up a bottle of Fix Plus. All of the staple. Next up, I have some hair products from TGIN. I have the Honey Miracle hair mask. I picked up two of these. I used this one time and I fell in love with it, so I picked it up. Also, I picked everything up when Ulta was having their 20% off coupon, so everything discounted. I'm just gonna get all the skincare products out the way. Next up, we have the well, first thing, beauty, the Ordinary Hyaluronic Acid Serum. This is my third bottle. I think every Ulta haul I've done so far on the show. I picked up one of these, but I'm almost out of mine again, so I picked up another one. This is my favorite soap. My favorite serum. This one in the Innisfree. I think I mentioned that last time, too. But yeah, those are my two favorite serums. Next up, we have the 4th Ray Beauty But First Face Milk Set. It's a mini set, I'm assuming, because the box is tiny. <laughs> it comes with the watermelon, the matcha, and the oat. Out of this set, I've only tried the matcha, and I love it. It's how tiny they are. And oh, they're so tiny. <laughs> oh, it's adorable. It's backwards. It's adorable. So yeah, it came with three of those in this little card. Next up, one of my favorite skincare brands. I have the First Day Beauty, the Fab Four little gift set. It comes with the face cleanser, the Ultra Repair Cream, which is the face cream I use every single night. The Radio, Radio? The Facial Radiance Pads and the Sunscreen little bag. Toss that. In my mirror. Here is the Ultra Repair Cream. The Radiance Pads, which I do love these. The Face Cleanser. And the Sunscreen. Okay, I think this is the last of the skincare. Next up, we have the Clean It Zero Cleansing Balm by Vanilla Co. This is their Jumbo one. I think it's a holiday exclusive. Don't quote me on that. I'm not sure, but look how big this one is. Last one I got, my last haul was like this big, so I'm excited to use this one. I also picked up the Juvia's Place Warrior 3 palette. Looks like this. We have a Kylie lip kit in the shade Jordy. Comes with the lip liner and the pencil. So the the lip, the lip liner. Oh my god, the liquid lipstick and the lip liner. What is this? I feel like on the box it looks darker. No, they're about the same shade. So there's that. Next up, we have two products from Elf. I picked up the ultra precise brow pencil in the shade Cool Brown. I want to get the shade black, but they don't, they didn't have it, and on Elf's website it was sold out too, so I picked up two of these. I picked up another Elf Hydrating Camel Concealer. I have this one in the shade Deep Cinnamon. This might be my favorite concealer. Well, I guess this is my second too, so yeah, another Elf Hydrating Camel Concealer. And I have some NYX products. I picked up another Sweet Cheeks, Sweet Cheeks Blush in the shade Totally Chill. It's a little light, but I think I can get away with it. Let me open it up. I'm struggling. Yeah, I already swatched it. It looks a little light, but I feel like if I mix it in with another blush, it'll be fine. So, next up, I have the NYX Bear With Me Tender Skin Veil. I picked up mine in the shade Deep Rich. I think this might be the second to last or the third to last shade. I, um, I swatched it a few days ago. It is so beautiful on the skin. I recommend it so far. The last two things that I picked up from NYX are two of their new releases. I have the brow glue, which looks like this. It said that it's not sticky. When I swatched it yesterday, it was kind of sticky, so we'll see. <laughs> and then the marshmallow primer. This smells exactly like marshmallows or like cotton candy. I feel like it does have a sort of a strong scent when you first apply it, but it does go away. I feel like you were sensitive to scents. You might not like it. 
I'll just be wary of that. My neighbor's weird. So Maybelline's eye products, I think, are eye products? Or the whole brand was buy to get, no, I think it was the eye products. It was buy to get one free, so I picked up three of the precise eyeliners. I have two in matte black, and the one in the middle is in forest brown. So the last three products I picked up are three staples in my collection. The first thing is the Essence Lash Princess Mascara. It's one of my favorite mascaras, and it's only $5, so highly recommend. My favorite lash glue, and the only lash glue that I will probably ever use, because lash glue and clear, yep. <coughs> lash glue and clear. And then the Ulta Juice Infused Lip Oil. I love these, they have so many scents. This is the tangerine one. I don't like it as much as the rose or the whole and peach one, but I do like it. Only thing bad about these are they leak. They leak everywhere. Do not leave it on your desk. Do not leave it in your bag. It will leak. That's the only downside about these, but they are really good. So guys, that's all for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys want to pick up any of the items, they're all linked down below in the description box. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you want to see more videos from Kataya and I. That's all for the video, and bye guys!